Hi, and welcome to another Biketronics video tutorial. In this video, we're going to explain how to install the Biketronics Crib Clicker. This device is a state-of-the-art, highly secure garage door and gate opener. It'll work with any vehicle and any garage door or gate actuator. It allows you to open your garage by simply flashing your high beams. The receiver can be paired with up to seven transmitters. The Crib Clicker kit contains one receiver, one transmitter, four PosiTap connectors, some Velcro, and a couple of zip ties. Installing the receiver. To install the receiver, start by disconnecting power from your door or gate motor. Use Velcro or zip ties to secure the receiver with the antenna pointing straight down. Locate the terminals with wires running to the wall switch and tap into those terminals with the black wires. Reconnect power to your garage door. Installing the transmitter. Disconnect your battery's negative cable and remove your fairing. Locate the high beam circuit and use a PosiTap connector on both the white and black wires to connect the transmitter to the circuit. Use Velcro or zip ties to secure the transmitter within the fairing. Reconnect your battery and turn on the bike. Flash your high beams twice. Your garage door should come up. If it doesn't, try flashing your high beams faster or slower. Reprogramming the receiver. Transmitters and receivers sold together are paired at the factory, so this step should not be necessary for brand new installations. However, if you feel the need to, you can double check your crib clicker pairing by using a 9 volt battery and a power adapter. You can also do this without the power adapter by installing the receiver on the garage door opener, but we prefer to do this at a workbench for the sake of simplicity. The power adapter is available at Radio Shack and needs to have a 6 volt, 300 milliamp rating and should come with one free tip. Get the white size end tip. Plug the adapter into the receiver. To put the receiver in pairing mode, hold down the reset button until the LED turns off. Now take the wires from your transmitter and press them into the terminals on the 9 volt battery. Open and close the circuit a few times until the LED flashes first dim and then bright. Wait 30 seconds and signal the receiver again. Any transmissions after the devices are paired should result in a single flash of the LED and you will be able to hear the relay switch click. Please note that the receiver will only enter pairing mode for 30 seconds, after which it will flash once. Troubleshooting. Some garage doors don't supply enough power for the receiver to operate, although the receiver will still flash when it receives a transmission. In these cases, it is necessary to use the power adapter mentioned previously as an additional source of power for the receiver. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. We hope you'll enjoy your new Biketronics Crib Clicker. For more instructional videos and special offers, visit us on the web at Biketronics.com.